Um, my hair looks an absolute hot mess. It is so dirty. Oh my goodness. So today is going to be a hair video. I haven't done one of these in a very long time because I've been quite over my hair. It's just not been acting the way it's supposed to be acting. And with the wedding coming up, I have been trying to focus more on health care, hair care, having healthy hair, growing out my hair, ensuring my hair is super moisturized, my ends are trimmed, and just ensuring that it is at its optimum optimal health. It has grown a bit, I think. Um, but recently my hair has been doing this thing where it has a lot of different textures all over the place. Like this, it, this section of my hair is my problematic section. And I've been trying to kind of get it back into working order or some type of order. Um, so what happens is, this is the only part of my hair I feel it does not take, it does not soak up water very well. Like I would spray water for days and it would just sit on the top of my hair. I know I have low porosity hair, but it, that section is the most problematic section. It doesn't curl properly. It just, it doesn't hold curls properly. It just is not, I don't know. It just, I just don't even know what happened. In today's video, I will be using the Curl Smith Bond Salve. I think that's what it's called. Let me get it. Let me get it. This little thing. It's called the Bond Curl Rehab Salve. It is for treatment for weak and damaged hair, and it's supposed to give your hair some resilience, protection, and bond stability. It has some really great ingredients in it. Chia seeds, shiitake mushrooms, prickly pear pulp, pumpkin seed oil, and guava kale. Um, and This is supposed to help with the hair elasticity, so I've been using this over the past month to try to bring some type of elasticity back into this area right here. And I have seen that after I use this, my curl pattern looks so much better. So I just wanted to hop on and show you guys how I use it and what my hair looks like before and what it looks like after. And so it's not gonna be anything fancy today. I'm just showing you guys what I do. I'm gonna pat it straight down the middle and then, then do like two, two different pots on the two different sections. Ooh. This is going to be a task today. I'm trying to figure out why my hair is so tangled. I didn't do anything. Maybe that's why it's so tangled. But yeah. I find that this is a very... Oh my goodness. This, this is just work. Okay. Okay. So I'm just going to leave... I'm gonna clear out both. I'm gonna clear out both sections first, and then apply the bond salve. Okay, so now the prep phase is completed. I have these four juicy twists. Now I am going to apply my product to my hair. I'm gonna start with the two back sections first. So I'm gonna just twist these up into a scrunchie. I don't know what my clips are. I am low on clips. Okay, so it says Curl Smith Bond Curl Rehab Salve is not a conditioner. It's a lightweight, intense treatment that makes hair look stronger and more resilient. Apply generously on damp hair until it's fully saturated. Leave on for a minimum of 15 minutes, longer if desired. Rinse off thoroughly and follow through with your favorite cleanser, conditioner, and stylus. So my hair is wet. This thing smells so delicious. Oh my God. I think I can smell a pear in it. it. Smells really good. So, oh, I think that may be too generous, but I used a healthy dollop and I'm just going to apply. It has really good slip. Oh, this smells so good. 
Let me get a little close though. This feels like a shampoo almost, to be honest with you guys. And then I'm gonna brush it through. Oh man, the smell is so good. So this is what my hair looks like. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more. And then move on to the other sections until my entire hair is completed. I'm gonna twist the back up too. And then just you know, wait my 15 minutes out. 15 to 20 minutes. Just twist, twist it up. So anyways, yeah, this is what my hair looks like. It smells delicious, feels amazing. And so I'm just gonna repeat this process around the four, well, the remaining three areas. I don't know what Curl Smith, like how they come up with their formulations, but <laughs> these things smell so so delicious it's like a tropical freaking rainforest like it smells all of their products smell really good and it's not a an overwhelming smell you know sometimes when people have scents companies have scents in their products they're overwhelming to the point of like if you have allergies or sinus problems like it flares up my sinuses but this is just this is chef's kiss okay so that's the two back and I'm just gonna go ahead and finish the two sections in the front. Okay, so that concludes my application process of the Bond Salve. Um, and so what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna put it in a plastic cap, wrap my hair in a plastic cap for 15 minutes and then go in the shower and wash it off and then condition it style it all that good stuff so yeah that is the end of this process i'm going to show you guys what the hair looks like when i get out of the shower just to show you guys how my curls kind of look um, it's a subtle look it's nothing like dramatic but i definitely see the difference in it as well as this side that is very i don't even know what to call it but yeah 15 minutes in the shower and then i'll come back out and show you guys the finished the finished hair so i am fresh out of the shower the only thing i added to my hair was some pattern leave-in conditioner and you can see my curls are defined um, but I will show you guys my trouble areas that I'm trying to work on. So no matter how much conditioner, no matter how much product, this area right here is a frizz ball. Like, I don't even understand what's going on. So it's really just, it has a mind of its own. Like, look at that area compared to like right here. I just don't know and this is what we're working on so it's just like <laughs> like look at it but anyway I do think that the bond salve is helping a little um so yeah that is going to do it for this video I'm just gonna continue to add product to my hair to try to tame this section um but yeah that is it for today's video <sighs> I might start doing hair videos again it's just the shower section. What you gotta film is a lot. But anyway, this is my hair. And 
Yeah, we are going through it right now. We are like going through it. But that is going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys want to see any specific hair videos, please do let me know. Um, yeah, I will see you guys right here for the next hair video whenever I decide to do it.